What a stunning morning. What an absolutely beautiful morning and what a gift it is another day. A gift to say thank you to Jesus. You know, it's Christmas time and we, we come together and celebrate Christmas and Christmas can be really crazy, it can be chaotic, but it can be also really beautiful. And I know many of us are reflecting on what is or has been quite a crazy year. But when you stop and you think about Christmas, you think about Jesus and it was that moment when peace finally arrived on earth. I always think about at Christmas time, God the Father and Jesus and the Holy Spirit. I think about them up in heaven after Adam and Eve sinned and the fall of man and how we were separated from them and the plan, the discussion about who will come down? Who will come down here? Because it was the only only way to help us and save us in our mess. Who will come down? Who will who will come down to earth and save us? And I just always picture Jesus going, I'll go. I'll go, Father. And so that's what he did. He came down in the form of a baby. He came down in the form. He stepped off that throne in heaven and came down as a baby to walk amongst us, to grow amongst us, to, to feel what we feel, to, to be tempted like we're tempted, to, to suffer like we suffer. And he suffered. Man, did that. Did Jesus suffer for you and I? And so every Christmas, I think about Jesus, the real meaning of Christmas. And so if you can have a moment, just stop and think about that moment when peace finally arrived on earth. He came down to save us, to heal us, to restore us back into right relationship with the Father. Know this day you are loved. You are never far from hope. You are never far from peace. It is just a prayer away. So I pray this day that you would have a visitation that he would come down and he would minister to you, that you would actually feel the tangible presence of God and that peace that surpasses all understanding will guard your heart and mind this day as you trust in him. Merry Christmas. Bye.